Hello YouTube world. Uh, today's subject I'd like to talk about is uh, New York police, well a couple of New York police officers beat up a Iraqi war veteran with a baton and they kept hitting him and kept hitting him. What is going on with these police officers out here? It's sad. I mean, it's, it's a lot of mess going on. Like the girl who got punched in the face by the police officer. I think they could have been did a better way, like tased her or pull out their gun and tell her to stop instead of hitting her in the face. But this guy, Iraqi war veteran who fought for this country, gets beat by a baton. It was a couple police officers. One police officer, I, I, I seen him just kept hitting the guy with a baton. They tried, The police officer kept trying to say that Iraqi veteran was kicking or trying to hit, hit them. But the truth of the videotape showing that they were lying. They try to cover themselves. Please comment. These police are getting outrageous right now. Uh, it's scary. We used to thought you had to worry about gangs and stuff like that. Now you got to worry about your own police department. It's scary. I mean, you get in a car, you're riding down the street. You more scared than a police officer than a gangster. That's how it looks. I mean. You get in the car, you see one, and you think, oh, man, they're going to pull me over. I mean, it's just scary part. Even though you ain't got nothing on you, you ain't got nothing they're coming after you for nothing, but it's still scary to have a police follow behind you. And I know people, not just minorities, but I know if they get a police officer to get behind them, I know they probably get nervous and scared. Some people do. A lot of people do. Just regular people. So we shouldn't have to be scared of the police officers. They're supposed to protect and serve the community, not beat beat the uh, people with batons or police brutality or try to cover their butt. All we got them, all the police officers are supposed to do is protect and serve, not be gangsters. And it's sad. I want our war, I mean, our Iraqi war veteran get beat by a baton. Just check out the... Uh, video you will see it happened in New York and he gets beat by baton and what they trying to do is cover they self the police officers try to cover they self but the tape do not lie they was trying to say that he was hitting them back and kicking at them which the tape tells the truth and it's sad that we have to be worried about our own police force you know the police officers who's supposed to protect and serve us we shouldn't be scared of them we should be able to unite and talk to them, not be scared. So, please comment on that and what you think about the guy getting beat, our, our war, Iraqi war veteran gets beat by a baton. And it's not just him, it's happening all around the United States. Pro police, police brutality. We need to stop this and hope the president is looking at this and the attorney general to uh, investigate police brutality because it's getting worse and worse and it might be because of the economy because they're getting cut back on hours too just like or getting laid off on their forces too so everybody is stressed out and depressed but you cannot take your depressed and your stressed out on people period and that goes from police officer to regular people too so it's sad every day we see something on the internet that police beat up a person or police shoot somebody so please comment on it what you think about this person and the people of New York please let me know what's going on with this case I know a little bit about it but I seen what I seen this guy did not hit at them or did nothing wrong towards them to be hit with a baton so please comment on this and we need to stand up America we need to take our country back it's sad that we have to worry about our own police force please comment on here and, and quit sending bad comments calling people names and stuff like that because it will get deleted I'm not gonna have that stuff on my page if you can't comment with your own opinion without calling somebody name or racist name please don't comment I'm here talking about the real thing this goes for all races not just one minority you don't hear me talking about minorities this, this happened towards any person not just one race Police brutality happen in everywhere. I see that on the internet or the news all the time. So please comment on this, what you think about it. 
and it's scared. We shouldn't have to be scared of our own police force. God bless everybody, and I will be back on here. I try to do a couple videos a week. But we need to talk about police brutality because it's getting outrageous right now, and it's sad. Please comment. Thank you.